Hi, I'm Mark. This is Mark Tech Vlogs on YouTube, and today I'm going to bring you guys a review of the Waterdrop WDUF10 under sink water filter. Now, of course, filtered water is nothing new, and probably everyone watching this has come across someone who's got one of those jugs that you fill up, and it takes a million years for it to filter through, and you just have to faff around filling it up all the time. And generally, these are fine if you want filtered water, but they do create a lot of waste as well with the size of the filters. And what we've seen over the last few years is more and more of these under sink filters coming. These are ones that hook up directly to your cold water tap and literally give you filtered water on tap. Now this one from Waterdrop is actually one of the most affordable ones out there, costing just £60 initially and then £30 for any kind of replacement filters. And because a filter lasts a year, that means your initial £60 is costing you a fiver a month and then your subsequent filters £2.50 a month. This is not a huge amount at all. And you'd probably pay more than that for a bottle of water in a W Smiths in a train station. And this makes this really affordable. I have also got a link below where you can save 10% off your order as well to make it that little bit more affordable. So let's talk about specification. So this filter hooks straight up to your cold water supply. And in terms of its filter ability, it has an accuracy of 0.5 UM. It is capable of reducing chlorine, taste and odor, sediment, rust, and other heavy metals. Presumably they don't mean Ramstein. What this means is a lot of the stuff in your water that you don't really want to be ingesting is taken out. And the things that are good for you that you want to stay in are kept in. It is also NSF, WQA and IAPMO certified. This means you know it is a safe product for you to use. And the actual filter is really easy to remove and it lasts up to 30,000 litres. You even get a little timer in the box that will flash red and beep after your year has passed to remember to change the filter. And then that filter top where you attach the actual filter body to has two sealing gaskets on it. This helps keep it all nice and watertight. And this leads us nicely to talk about what you get in the box. So of course you get the filter itself and that little mounting block that it goes into. You also get two pipes and then you get two pipe size adapters as well. In addition to that, you get some instructions and some PTFE tape. What this means is that for most people, other than a wrench, you've pretty much got everything you need to get it installed in the box. They even include two screws. So let's talk about installation. So if you already have a flexible pipe to your cold water supply from your tap, then this is so easy to install and you could do it in 10 minutes. And essentially to install it, you first want to turn off the cold water supply. Then you remove the flexible pipe that is coming from your tap from the cold water supply, but keep it attached to your tap. Next, you're going to want to mount a filter holder into your cabinet. And then you're going to use the provided flexible pipes, and in my case, the pipe adapters as well, in order to attach them to the various things. That means one goes to your cold water supply and into the in part of the filter, and then the other goes from the out part of the filter and attaches onto your flexible pipe coming from your tap. Now, I took the approach of doing most of these up initially by hand and then doing a couple of turns with my wrench. Of course, you want to be careful to make sure you don't damage your pipes and don't overturn them as well. Then the final thing to do is pop the filter in, which is really easy to do. You just feel for when it slots in and give it a half turn so it's facing the front. And then you turn the water on, check there's no leaks, and then you want to run your tap for five minutes just to calibrate the filter. This was a really easy process, and actually I think for most people you could easily do it in less than 10 minutes. And the instructions that come with it are nice and easy to follow as well. So let's talk about using it and whether it works or not. Now I could do a load of water tests if I had the equipment, but I'm going to trust the certifications that it has because they're from external bodies. The real question for me as a consumer and for you guys as well is does it make your water taste better? And as someone who lives in a, a pretty hard water area, I can say it does make my water taste better. And it makes my water taste far closer to bottled water than tap water. And using this thing is as simple as turning on the cold tap. And out of that, you get filtered water for whatever it is you want to do whether that's having a drink or brewing some beer or to cooking your vegetables. One thing to note is that I did notice a small change in pressure between pre-installation and post-installation. This isn't enough to be bothered about in my opinion, but it is just worth sharing as part of this review. And of course, filtered water doesn't just taste better, but because there's less impurities in it, it's healthier for you. And if you've been on this channel for a while, you'll know that I do some kind of basic homebrew stuff with a pinter kit. And being able to use filtered water in that is gonna make even better beer. So all in all, what's the verdict on this water filter from Waterdrop? And really, this is a really affordable product with a filter that is super easy to replace. And it gives you effortless filtered water literally on tap. 
And it really does change the way your water tastes. And of course, it takes away the effort that you have with filtered jugs. It reduces the waste that you had with all the filters that go with them. And it gives you something that you don't have to worry about changing all the time. You literally change it once a year. And it means you get good taste in water, whether you're brewing beer or just drinking water. And this is certainly a product I would recommend. If you do want to pick one up, I have put a link below. There's two links below. Both of those are affiliate links. One goes directly to Waterdrop's website themselves and there's a 10% voucher for you to use there. The other goes to Amazon, which is where I purchase mine. This isn't a video that's been sponsored by a manufacturer. I've just bought one for myself and wanted to share a review. If you've got any questions, do stick them below. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys again soon.